coach said the other day that uh, you know he was happy with the D line's play, but we, we, he said you know we're going to have to do it by committee. Mm -hmm. uh, what's your assessment of the situation? Um, I'm sure it's not much different than the head coach. But well, I mean, I, well, I, I, well, you you know we got four seniors there: um, Deloach, um, Bailey, uh, Mays, um, and Dawson. So we're hoping that those guys. Can, can be solid for us there and hope like um, a guy like John Atkins can, can come on and, and be a solid contributor there and and then after that you know it's, it's just it's young and the restless behind him <laughs> so you know we're just hoping the those the old ones keep getting better and the, and John Atkins keeps maturing and, and most of all the young ones keep maturing and, and learning how to play this game um, but it, it's up and down to the young ones a, a, a lot more than the old ones. But uh, we're going to need them eventually. And um, but we'll hopefully we can start off with the older ones uh, holding on. Is it a position, put you guys in a position where sometimes you might just have to line, line those young guys up loose and turn them loose out there and, and just kind of let them make the mistakes on the fly? Well, I, well you say you want to, they're going to have to go out there eventually, yes. but. We, we, we're trying to let them have the mistakes over here at the bus before we go to the big place. <laughs> and um, I think if we can get that, get them a little bit more comfortable and understand the game speed, understanding the defense and, and the techniques that we want, the more and more they're going to feel better. But I think the more, what's been surprisingly about the young ones, every time we went to the stadium, the first time was a shocker. The second time they got a little bit comfortable. His last time went, it was a lot more comfortable. So that's been a plus. And um, everybody gets a little bit nervous when the time you go over in that stadium.